Hi, good evening, everyone. Good evening. Hi, Hi guys. How are Hi, you teacher. Hey, nice to see you, everyone. <coughs> good good night. To see you. Hey, good evening. How are you guys? Thank, yeah, you. Mejor, teacher. Thank you so much. Yes, much better. Thank you. Gracias por los mensajes. Muchas gracias. Sí, ayer me sentía que me dio fiebre, dolor de cabeza y en la garganta. Sentía que, no, dije, hoy no lo voy a lograr. <ríe> Muchas gracias por su comprensión, por los mensajes. Muchas gracias. Les agradezco un montón. Qué bueno verla ya mejor. Sí. Yeah, thank you very much. It's good to see you. Ya extrañaba verlos. <laughs> Gracias. After a long time, wow. I say, I need primero, to... primero nos abandonó Ada y después dimos, no, yeah. no puede ser que nos abandone Sandrita. Dimos. What happened with Ada? Acabo de ver a Ada. <laughs> <laughs> no puede ser, dimos otro. <laughs> es el acabose del módulo 2. <laughs> <laughs> hey, how was the day for you? ¿Cómo estuvo su día? How was it? Súper bien, gracias a Dios. Bien mojado, bien empapado. Raining, right? Está lloviendo en muchas partes. Acá acaba de empezar a llover recio. Acá está lloviendo. Acá también está lloviendo. Yes, sí, es que eh, avisaron, ¿verdad? Que a mí no me costó lloviendo. entrar a la plataforma. Oh, yes, because, ajá. Uh -huh. Según dicen, island. va a estar así esos días, como que va a haber una onda tropical, al parecer. No termina de salir una cuando viene otra, iré. Y mucha ahorita gente estaba así como usted estaba ayer. Sí, es que es viral, ahorita se está pegando sí. bastante. Aquí ya caímos tres en la casa <ríe> con el virus. Y mi hija ahorita sí ha estado, bueno, desde ayer sí. con anda el dolor de cabeza, eh, anda como que se le empieza la gripe. Mm, es y, bien. Bueno. Bien, bien incómodo, ¿verdad? Bien, bien difícil. No es como antes, la gripe es como daban como un poco leve y ahora no. Unas pringuitas le caen a uno, o medio recibe el viento, o el aire con... Decía, decía mi abuelita antes, una tapsin y ya estuvo, y las tapsin Ajá. era un gran, una gran cosa, ¿verdad? ¿Hoy qué? No. Hoy no, pero... Nos tomamos no. toda la farmacia y no mejoramos. Es cierto, uno Cabal. estaba de comprar medicamentos y esto, lo otro, y nada cae bien. Ya, no, con esto después de de la pandemia, ¿verdad? Creo que lo ha dejado a uno más débil. Ha dejado más fuertes los virus. Sí, sí, más fuertes. Más inmunes. Más débil, yes. Definitely. O ya no hacen la pastilla más fuerte. Ajá. Ya las hacen. Sí. Ya Son no. buenas para que uno compre más. <risa> ya no, eso es cierto. Ya es más resistente a la... El, el virus ya está más resistente a los medicamentos. La farmacia Cajabal. más millonarias ahora. Cajabal. Pero qué bueno verla de nuevo, teacher. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much. So, we'll continue here again. Okay? We work with the simple present, right? We do and the does. And we got an exercise here that was in the platform. Let's check this one. Linda, you in an apartment, what's the best option? Is do no, live no, or which one? That's... Do live. I'm sorry? Do, do live. and live, no. right? Yeah. Live. Do. Do. do, right? Correct. Do. Why? Because do. the subject is you. And here, the form of the verb you like. is live. Aha. Uh -huh. Live. Excellent. That's correct. Live. Do you live in an apartment? In an apartment. That's all right. Great one. Okay. So let's check. In the other part, we're going to continue with some furniture. Furniture are all of the elements that we need in our house to be comfortable. So let's see some vocabulary. We have armchairs, different than sofa, right? Remember armchairs, they are different. You can sit in armchairs, but in a sofa, you can lay down and sleep. We also have table, bookcase, coffee table, dresser, stove, curtains, 
microwave oven, chairs, mirror, refrigerator, pictures, clock, lamps, sofa, we got mirror, rug, television or TV, right? It's possible you can say TV, desk, bed. So we have different elements here. Now, let's see an exercise here. It says, which rooms have the things in part A? We're going to complete the chart. For example, the kitchen has a table, has a stove. What else? What else has a, a kitchen? What the other microwave. furniture? Uh -huh. Microwave. Ah, yes, yeah, that's true. A microwave oven. Refrigerator. 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 What else? Microwave oven. Uh -huh. We have here microwave oven. Chairs. Sometimes. Chairs. Ah, yes. Good. Sometimes you have chairs. What else? Curtain. Ah, yes. Curtains. We have different decorations. Yes. ¿Cómo se dice hay en inglés? Hay, del verbo haber. ¿Sí? There is, there is and there are. There, there, um, there is, there. cuando es singular, y there are, cuando es plural. De hecho, there is. pasamos, ajá, de, de hecho, y vamos a ver ese <coughs> tema. There is and there are. With this one. There is ajá, and there are. Ajá, que eso le iba, le iba a decir que, eh, o sea, por ejemplo, decir, in my, in my kitchen, there is. There is, ajá, uh -huh. yes, that's Cortain. good. Ah, that's good. If you say that is only one curtain, there is a curtain. Si hay más de una cortina, there are curtains. Curtain. Ajá, uh -huh, that's correct. So you could say, there are curtains in my kitchen. There is a microwave oven in my kitchen. There is a refrigerator. Ajá. Uh -huh. Solo se puede decir yes. one... One curtain. No, you can say plural. Tampoco se puede utilizar el plural. There are curtains. Hay cortinas. O, el, o el, eh, la cantidad específica. There are two curtains, three curtains. Ah, porque en in my, in my in the kitchen, mm -hmm. in my kitchen. In my kitchen. There is. There is Ajá. One curtain. One curtain. If it's singular, right? Or if it's plural, uh -huh. in my kitchen, there are two curtains, uh -huh. three curtains, uh -huh. or some curtains, algunas cortinas. Se puede utilizar de varias maneras. <clears throat> el desayunador, how do, you, how do you say desayunador? That can be breakfast area. Oh, uh -huh. okay. Or breakfast table, you can say also. Breakfast table. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. What about dining room? What can we find in a dining room? Remember, dining room is the area where we eat, el comedor. Area de comida. Ajá, uh -huh, correct. We can find a table. Clock. The chair. Uh -huh. Ah, chairs. They're very important. Yes, chairs. What else you said? Clock, right? You said clock. TV, right? You're eating and you watch TV. Yes, possibly. <laughs> what else? Curtains. Curtains. Yes. Pictures. Ah, picture. That's true. Pictures. What else can you find in a dining room? Radio. Ah, okay. Radio. What else? Clock. Clock, yes, we have a clock. Oh, Lamp. Uh-huh, what else? Lamp. Lamps, mm -hmm. ah, yes. Yes, people sometimes have also lamps. We got pictures, all right. What about in the living room? Teacher, por ahí le estaban escribiendo unos compañeros, no sé si vio los chats. Let me check. Oh, they cannot listen. Para decir mi yeah, okay. trasero o, ¿cómo se llaman las otras? 
que son de madera. Ah, oh, those Para are the cabinets. Cabinets. No. No. You can say cabinets. Yes. ¿Y cuál es yes. la diferencia entre ese gavetero no, y, no, y aquel? Sería... Porque hay un desk y un dresser. A dresser. Uh -huh. Oh, what happened here is that in the case of a dresser, is the ones that uh, you put clothing. Normal, normalmente en un dresser uno le coloca ropa, como un gavetero. Y aquel es escritorio. Y este de acá es un escritorio. Ajá. Uh -huh. So that is a desk. De trabajo. Ajá, uh -huh, correct. It can be office desk. Muchas veces office desk, como el que tiene en la oficina. O desk puede ser también el de la escuela, que aquí le llamamos pupitre, pero es un escritorio. You say desk, but this one is an office desk. Es escritorio de oficina o el que tenemos en casa también. Thank you, Miss. You're welcome, but they look very similar, right? So this is like gavetero, donde guardamos la ropa. But also you can say drawer. Drawer. Que también es un gavetero. Que ahora hay hasta de plástico. Right? You go to EPA and you can find plastic <laughs> rubber. You go to EPA, you say, oh, okay, that's nice. Ratán, de ratán. <laughs> y parecen de madera. <laughs> Pero siento que se caen, no se caen. No, a saber. Mm, son bien efectivos, es que... son, son bien, son ah. bien. Yo es tengo ahí que... ropa de mis hijas. Ajá, y no se caen. Son... No, Toca es que, es que hay unos que son más resistentes. Hay unos que son más dobles. Depende de la marca, porque hay unos que sí son bien sencillos, hay otros que no. Uh -huh. Entonces todo, todo depende de la marca que usted compre. Yes. Pero sí, a esos, entonces que... a esos, a esos, ¿cómo se les puede decir si son de plástico? It's a drawer, es un gavetero, drawer. Just that if it's plastic, it's plastic drawer. Un oh, gavetero yeah. de plástico. Also you can gavetero. say like a metal, si es de metal, metal drawer. Or wooden drawer, also, si es de madera. Pero ahí estaríamos drawer. ya colocándole el adjetivo, ¿verdad, Miss? Ajá, como para... El propósito es el mismo, pero el material es diferente. Correcto. Plastic. Drawer como tal, entonces es el gavetero. Es un gavetero. Y así le ponemos plastic, le estamos diciendo de que está hecho. Eh, that's correct, you say the material. Wooden, plastic, metal. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ratán. Ratán. Yes, very... Popular is now Ratan. Okay, let's go okay. ahead then. Go in the living room. What things do we find in the living room? Sofa. Sofa. Sofa, yes. What yes. else? Television. Draw Rock, television. Uh -huh. Coffee table. Coffee table. Coffee table, yes. To take the coffee or the tea, right? Coffee table. Mirror. 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 Uh -huh. What else? Mirror. 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 The rug. The rug. Uh -huh. the Correct. You can find a rug. What else? Bookcase. Lamps. Bookcase. Yes, it's true. Clock. Bookcase. Clock. Case. Clock. Yes. Lamps. 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 Book. You have lamps. The bookcase. The rug. Ah, the rug. Uh -huh. We have the rug. Pictures also. The they rug. are very common. Yeah, that's true. Pictures. What about the bedroom? What things can we find in a bedroom? Lamps. Lamps. What else? Curtains. Curtains. Ah, the bed that's very important in a bedroom. Bed. What else? Dresser. A dresser. Yeah, that's true. Lamps. Ah, the mirror. Lamps. We have mirror. Mirror. Yeah, that's true. Living also important. Sala. Living room. Ah, it's the sala. Table. Table. TV. Yes. TV. Sofa. Yes. Sofa. Curtains. 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 Pictures. Pictures, uh -huh. curtains. Smart so TV. Elements. A smart TV, yes. <laughs> Sometimes the speakers, right? Or the radio. Computer. 
a home theater. You can feel <laughs> like in the movie theater, right? You're watching a movie in Cinemark <laughs> with popcorn. <Okay. laughs> so that's good. Okay, so we can find different elements, existence or possessions also that you have in different spaces of your rooms, right? Or your house. Now let's check here. We're going to watch the video. The video, it contains vocabulary of furniture. Miss, aquí está lloviendo bien fuerte, casi no escucho y no tengo carga en los audífonos. Okay, try, okay. Si no nos, no nos responde, vamos a saber que no nos escucha entonces. <laughs> Trate de participar, okay. <laughs> Let me check here. We're going to put the previous. This one. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn vocabulary. No problem with the video? No. No? no. Okay. Please, if you put it in black, don't put it in black. In blue? It's okay with this color? In blue. Las letras. Okay, let me check. Okay, let me check. All items. Let's get started by yes? listening and repeating the vocabulary. No, Misa, no. no. Okay, entonces lo voy a dejar en pequeño. Lo voy a dejar ajá, en pequeño. Ajá, yo creo que al expandirlo. Porque, ajá. Porque... Sí, porque no me da la opción acá de cambiarlo de color. Lo tendría que dejar así, en pequeño. Sí, así. Yes. Sí, okay. Así está bien en pequeño. Oh, okay. Así está bien, Miss. Very good. Curtains. Thank you. You're welcome. Pictures. Clock. Bed. Table. Coffee table. Microwave oven. Refrigerator. Lamps. Sofa. Desk, bookcase, dresser, chairs, mirror, rug, television. Other vocabulary that is important to understand is kitchen, dining room, living room, bedroom. And now let's practice using the vocabulary that we just heard by making statements about your kitchen, dining room, living room, and bathroom. For example, my living room has a sofa, a rug, and a television. My dining room has After you complete this exercise, please share your work in our discussion forums. Okay, so you saw there that vocabulary. Now we're going to create other examples here. With the furniture that we got here, as you notice, it mentioned about the kitchen, the dining room, living room, bedroom, and it says, my living room has a sofa, a rug, and a television. My dining room has, and here we're going to complete. So here we have some. Let's erase these ones. All right, let's start here. Kevin, can you start, please? Describe your kitchen. Okay, my kitchen has a, a stove. Very good. And the desk. A desk? Your kitchen? 
sería como un mueble para platos. No sé cómo sería, tengo Ah, que ok. pensar. It's a Uh -huh. dish, a dish table or a dish cabinet. You can also say Ok, a dish cabinet. dish cabinet and un lavaplatos. Mm -hmm. mm, that's good. In a English? dishwasher, a dishwasher. Dishwasher and serían como algunas cocinas tienen como muebles arribita. ¿Cómo sería eso? Uh, repisas, uh -huh, como yes. repisas, pantry. shelves or ah, pantry, como el famoso yes. pantry, pantry. Okay, so son pantries, uh -huh. no son repisas, verdad? So they can Only be one. okay, and a pantry. A pantry. All right. That's a good one. Yes. Thank you so much. Good. Juan Cabrera, continue. My dining room has. My dining room has a table. Very good. A table. It's a table. A television. A television. What about the chairs? As uh, chairs, 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 <coughs> uh, curtains, ah, curtains, the uh, picture, pictures, only one picture, uh, two, two pictures, okay, two pictures, uh, pictures, a uh, clock, a clock, and a clock, uh huh. That's right. Thank you. That's great. Good. Sandra Guadalupe, continue. Bedroom. My bedroom has... My bedroom, my bedroom has a, a table. Okay. A table. A bookcase. Mm, okay. A bookcase. Um, our chairs, armchairs. Uh, What else? Uh, Sorry. A rug. A rug. Room. A rug. Um, and bed. Okay, and a bed. And a bed. Very good, thank you. Nice. Continue, Judy. Now describe um, your living room. Don't worry. <laughs> Compartimos ese sentimiento. We feel, share that feeling. My living room has. Uh -huh. has Uh, sofa. Mm -hmm. A sofa. Mm. Son tres, en este caso sería, tengo que dar la cantidad o solo. No sofa? necessarily, you okay. decide. Okay. A sofa, a coffee table. Mm, that's good. A coffee Tele table. Television. A television. Um, a room. A rug. Uh, pictures. Pictures? Only one? Sí. Or yeah. plural? Two pictures. Ah, okay. Two pictures. Lamps. Lamps? Yes. Mm. Um, um, clock. And a clock. <clears throat> Very good job. Thank you. Nice. Okay. Nevi, continue. Now describe your dining room. Mm, my dining room has microwave oven. Ah, that's good. A microwave oven. Clock. A clock. A curtain. A curtain. A chair. A chair. Table. And a table. Nice one. Okay. Blanca, continue. 
Describe your bedroom. Um, sería, uh, has a armchair. An armchair. Uh, um, a bookcase. And that's good. A bookcase. Uh, a coffee table. Mm, that's good. A coffee table. Es que bedroom es, es cuarto, ¿verdad? Sí. Dormitorio. Uh -huh. ¿En Entonces, the bed? Entonces no sería coffee table, ¿verdad? Sometimes people do it. Hay personas que si pasan a la visita. Mm, to the bedroom. Okay. It's possible. You can have an mm. armchair, bookcase, coffee table. Eh, yes. Okay. Eh, sería yes. curtains, 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 curtains. Mm -hmm. Um, mirror. Ah, a good. mirror. A mirror. Es que eso tiene que casi todo, este. <laughs> la, They share, comparten, televisa. verdad, muchos elementos de, de otras partes. Yes, a mirror, a TV. Do you have a TV? See, yes, a TV, yes. the bedroom, all right. You have a TV. Yes. Sometimes you have a rock. Well, you have the armchairs, chairs. Y, Some people y, have a chair too. Y bed, in bed, perdón. A ver. You know, some people also have a refrigerator. Personas que tienen uh -huh. refri en la cama, right? <laughs> <laughs> they have it there. Yeah, that's true. Okay, we have this one. Now we're going to read them. Miss, read. Yes, Nevi, tell me. En el caso de mesa de noche, ¿cómo se podría decir? Night table. Night, night table. Uh, porque comúnmente en los dormitorios eso es lo que hay, ¿verdad? Ajá, donde se pone la lámpara. Por, por eso es que me, 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 puse, me puse a pensar coffee table, este, como que no mucho. <risa> It Quería depends. Me... Hay, hay en algunos lugares en los que las personas, cuando el cuarto es bien grande y quieren mm. pasar a su visita, a lo mejor amiga, ¿verdad? La pasan, yeah. ya, si quiero contar, <laughs> they pass, right? And they yeah. drink the coffee and they just start, mm -hmm. right? Having the conversation. Okay. <laughs> Or the bookcase, in the case that you want to read and before you go to bed. So people, sometimes they have it. Thank you, Miss. The refrigerator. <laughs> You're very welcome. Okay, now let's read them. Continue. Kenya Vanessa, read the first one, please. My kitchen. Let's read it, please. Let's read it, please. My kitchen has a stove. My kitchen has a stove. My kitchen? Um, uh, my kitchen? Repeat. Just repeat uh, it. My kitchen? Uh -huh, good. Has oh, okay. a stove. Repeat it, repeat it. My kitchen has a stove. Uh -huh. a this cabinet. 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 Mm -hmm. a this washer mm -hmm. and a pantry. Very good. Thank you. Continue, Sandra Guadalupe. Teacher. Yes. Una este mm -hmm. y, y los también los que son los bed, este los bed, ¿cómo se llama? Paño, padro. The mm -hmm. bathroom? Esa, esa sería solo toilet. Ah, the toilet is the object. Toilet is uh -huh. nada más el inodoro. Y bathroom, pero, ese es, pero bedroom es bathroom es baño. Ese es el baño. Uh -huh. Bathroom. Bathroom. Porque es el cuarto del baño. De es baño. El uh -huh. Área del baño. In the case sí. that you have a, um, for example, a shower. For example, if you say, my bathroom has, tiene, right? A shower, a shower, shower. porque es la ducha. Mm -hmm. Has a shower, okay. a bathtub. Bathtub in the case that you have, for example, eh, una tina. Uh -huh. That's the bathtub. 
a toilet. A toilet. What else? Mm -hmm. What else do you have? What else do you have in a in a bathroom? In a bathroom. A mirror. Yes, that's true. A mirror. What else? A mirror. Miss. Yes. Puede ser room. Uh, sorry. Una alfombra room. That's true. A rug. What else? Hi. Miss cafetera, ¿cómo se dice? Ah, that's a coffee maker. In the case, coffee maker. Coffee maker. In the case of the kitchen, like here. A coffee maker. Es una cafetera. Hay yes. muchas marcas, mis que nombres de cosas entonces tienen. Ah, yes, coffee true. Coffee maker es una marca. Is it a brand? Quiere decir cafetera esa marca. Cafetera. Coffee maker es cafetera. ¿En qué, mar ¿En qué productos lo ha visto? En... ¿Cómo se llama? Cremas. Eh, como cremora. Ah, really? Ah, ok. No. No, 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 no. This one is coffee mate. Ah. Yes. Coffee mate es como la pareja del café. Ah, no es Porque maker. va acompañada, no maker. Como maker el complemento. Es como el complemento, ajá, lo que le falta, <coughs> lo que le agrega. Ajá, como la cremora. Es complemento. Ajá, es que, es que es una marca de cremora. Entonces ese ajá. sería el complemento del café. ¿Es del café? Sí. Es el complemento. What, okay. uh, it's an additional. Additional. Calorías. Uh, coffee mate. Ajá, uh -huh. yeah. <laughs> That's true, calories. It's a lot of calories, definitely, yes. Oh, mm. Yes, Kenya? No, iba a decir, o, o si, lo, si digamos, si lo acompañamos al café con leche, sería coffee milk. No, it's coffee with milk. Ah, Ahí es ah, café ah. con leche, porque ya es, ambos ingredientes coffee. se juntan. Coffee with milk. Mm. O oh, milk with coffee. Okay. You can add, add food to that. So Teacher, in the case of, yes, tell me. Hay unos baños en, en los que tienen unas cositas que son como para colocar los champús. No sé cómo se llaman eso, los, donde ah, se coloca el jabón. Those are like a, organizadores, dice. Ajá, uh -huh, they are organizers. <coughs> organizers, so. like this, organizers. I repeat all of the things, organizers, organizadores. Y es correcto que yo diga organizer the bathroom. Organ oh, bathroom organizers. Bathroom Porque primero or va a ir como la característica, like bathroom ¿Y organizers. ¿Para qué lo va a utilizar? Ajá, correct. Bathroom mm -hmm. organizers. Uh -huh. Because organizers can be in general, right? But the ones you put in the bathroom, maybe you put them in the living room, in the office, or also. How do you shelves. say? How do you say repisa? Shelves. Shelf is singular. Shelf. Pero si quiero utilizar el plural, tendría que ser shelves. 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 Shelf is singular, and shelves is plural. So normally, for example, uh, in a bathroom, people put shelves. Or in the bedroom, I think in all of the areas of the house, it are necessary to put some, to organize the different things. Mm -hmm. so you Eso use means, okay. in la primera oración que dijo <coughs> Kevin, creo yo fue, que uh, dice, this cabinet y this washes, this, this washes, cabinet. Right? This cabinet y dishwasher. dishwasher. Está diciendo washer. que entonces primero la característica que son y para luego los luego el nombre. Ajá. Ah, correcto. Like, el propósito y luego el elemento. Dishwasher. Like cabinets. Uh -huh. Es un gabinete, okay. pero para los platos. Ajá. Y eh, lo mismo para washer. lavar platos, correcto. Ajá, correct. Un lavaplatos. Thank you, Miss. You're very welcome. Ok, so we have these ones, these examples. Now, let's go ahead with the other topic. But first, let's go ahead with the attendance list. Let me know if you are present, please.
Ahí después poner las oraciones, mis. Yes. Quería anotar otra cosa. That is good. Let me check here. <coughs> Okay, let's see. Aaron, Aaron Alberto. Present, Miss. Thank you. Alba Marisol. Present, Miss. Thank you so much. Blanca Rosa. Present. Yes, thank you. Elmer de Nilsson. Present. Elmer, thank you, Elmer. Evelyn Yesenia. Present. Thank you, Evelyn. Fernando de Jesus. Thank you. Glenda Guadalupe. Glenda Guadalupe. Juan Alberto. Present. Thank you. I'm here, Miss. Thank you. Kenia Vanessa. Present, Miss. Thank you, Kenia. Kevin Adrián. <coughs> Kevin Adrián. María Emilia. Present teacher. Thank you. Oh, yes. Thank you, Kevin. Thank you. Thank you, María Emilia. Melba Patricia. Melba Patricia. Glenda Guadalupe Ramírez dijo presente y present? Melba Patricia presente oh, yes. en, en el chat. Thank you so much. Nevi, yes, you are there, Nevi. I'm here, Miss. Yes, you're here. Thank you. Rafael Antonio. Mr. Nevi. <laughs> Nevi. <laughs> Rafael Antonio. I present, Miss. Thank you, Rafael. Rebeca Vanessa. Okay. Rebeca Vanessa. Sandra Guadalupe. Present, Miss. Thank you, Sandra. Sandra Margarita. Present. Thank you. Jacqueline Marioris, Jacqueline, and Judy Edith. Present, Miss. Thank you so much, guys. All right, let's go on then. Teacher, o sea que si nosotros le escribimos directamente acá en el chat, no ve usted los mensajes. A veces sí los puedo ver, pero a veces no me aparecen hasta acá, hasta que me salgo de allá de la lista. Por ejemplo, uh -huh. I have Melba, yes, I have Melba Patricia, Glenda. Yes, ok, now I can see them. All right. So we have the sentences here. Do you have questions? No questions. Okay. Es que es más complicado estar con el teléfono que con la computadora, definitivamente. It's different, uh -huh. Sí, no, me hace no, falta No se ve computer. toda, no tiene eh, completa visión, ¿verdad? It's different no. than the computer. Okay, Miss. Yes, Thank all right. You. Yeah. You're very yeah. welcome. Good, nice. Okay, now let's continue here with the other topic. And this one is about the use of there is and there are. We have there is and there are to express existency. Para expresar el verbo haber en español. We have for singular nouns is there is and for plural nouns is there are. For example, there is plus singular noun. You have, there is a sofa in the living room. For example, this is a living room. And we have, so there is existence of a, a sofa. Then we have, there is an armchair. The armchair is here and is only one. Let's see negative. There is no TV. I don't see TV. No existence of TV in this area. Or you can say there isn't a TV 
in the living room. So it can be the two options here. There is no, and you put singular form, or there isn't a TD. But the two forms are negatives. Miss, isn't? pero ese no yes. le hace falta la T o así se va a escribir. No, it's correct. This one. You cannot say like there is not. In oh, the case, God. si utilizamos como el determinante o el artículo A, entonces sí va a llevar isn't. Como el negativo acá. There isn't a TV. Or there is no TV. Ese there is no TV no es muy común. Es más común utilizarlo así como there isn't. There isn't a TV. There isn't, if you say a cell phone. There isn't a dog. There oh. isn't a picture, for example, a kitchen. So it's, it's optional. There is no. En esta forma estamos utilizando, digamos, la afirmación. Si es positivo de there is, entonces puedo utilizar el no. Pero solo no, la N y el la no. O. no. Ajá, that's correct, only no. Pero si utilizo la forma negativa junto con el verb to be, entonces utilizo the recent. Y luego el singular, a TV. No podría ir como the recent TV. The recent a TV. A TV. Ajá. Pero o siempre significa no como una negación. Siempre es la negación, solo que hay dos formas de utilizarlo para expresar uh, una existencia o inexistencia. Pero casi no es muy común ese, eh, solo el, el no, ¿verdad? Uh, no, it's not very common. Mm -hmm. It's more common to use a, a contraction. Más común utilizar una, una contracción. We can write other okay. examples. Miss. Yes, tell me. Pero se puede decir, there isn't a TV. There isn't a TV. Yes, uh -huh. aquí da la otra opción. There isn't a TV. There isn't a TV One in the kitchen. Un ejemplo está aquí con in the, tel, in the living room para hacer como el, a donde no hay televisión. Exactly. Uh -huh. Es para expresar la inexistencia, inexistencia de algo en algún uh -huh. lugar. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So let's see other examples. Others that can apply. Give me more examples, please. Examples podría ser in my there bedroom is. isn't the recent uh, isn't a mirror. Ajá, the recent empezamos la oración con the recent a mirror in my bedroom, right? Mm, eso sería al revés. Al revés, como suena, lugar. ajá, porque suena como más ordenado. Oh, tal okay. vez se puede utilizar, ¿verdad? In my bedroom, pero utilizamos coma. In my bedroom, there isn't, porque necesita como una pausa. Ajá. There isn't a rug. There isn't a rug. Ajá. There isn't. In the living room. A rug. In the living room. Yeah, that's true. No rug. There isn't a rug in the living room. Yes. What else? I don't give us another example. There is. There isn't. There is a refrigerator. Refrigerator? Do you see a refrigerator here in the living room? In the... But look, in, in this area, in esta area, in la sala, hay refrigerador? It's, it's, it's not... It's ah, a, it's it will be a, negative. There, there isn't no... Aha, uh -huh. refrigerator. A refrigerator mm -hmm. in the so living you, room. That's good. So you can say there is no refrigerator <clears throat> in the living room. It's, it's, a, it's a singular, singular. Aha, uh -huh, because it's a singular and it's negative. When you have negative, there is no refrigerator. No hay refrigerador. In it's one. Yes? It's one. It's one only one. Aha, uh -huh, correct. It's only one. 
When you use singular, you say there is. But there are is for the plural. There are. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. That's for the plural. So there is no refrigerator in the living room. Kevin, continue, please. Now give us one affirmative, please. Affirmativa de la de arriba. An affirmative uh -huh, of this. According to the uh, picture, what do you observe in is, the picture? There is no... Affirmative. Use affirmative. Positive. Ah, there's a picture. All right. There's a picture. In the living room. That's so okay. One. Good one. You can also say on the wall. Sobre la pared. There's a picture on the wall. On the Out. wall. You can also make a contraction using there's. It's the same as saying there is. There's a picture y, on the wall. Yes, tell me. Y, y en esta, en esta en, entraría el, como que yo diga, tiene. Yeah, it can be, tiene. but you use different structure. Pero ella utiliza una estructura diferente. Es como los ejemplos que dábamos anteriormente. Esto es solo para nosotros. Eh, esto es solo para expresar lo que hay, lo que hay o no hay en un lugar. Wow. En, en el que expresábamos anteriormente utilizábamos, por ejemplo, my kitchen has. Uh -huh. Mi, Mi cocina, cocina tiene. Tiene eh, tales, tales cosas, ¿verdad? Tal mueblería, eh, has a microwave, pero esta es como otra forma de expresarlo, las cosas que hay. En cada uh -huh. lugar. Ah, okay, Entonces, okay. El verbo haber is existency. Can be a singular, okay. can be plural, negative, or it can be affirmative. Mm -hmm. Yes. Thank you. You're welcome. Give us another example. Fernando, Fernando, are you present? <laughs> present. Yes. All right, Fernando. Give us another example, please, with affirmative. There's a table mm -hmm. in the living room. That's correct. Excellent. There's a table in the living room. So we see the existence of one table in the living room. Yeah, that's all right. Okay. We got this, this other example. Uh, yes. Question. Yes. ¿Cómo se dice planta? Porque veo que ahí en la imagen ah, hay una planta. Plants. plants. Actually, we have two plants. Two ah. plants. Sí, ajá, two plants. In that case, it will be plural form. It's like o sea, here. Cuando es plural, se, sería there, there, there are. are. Exactly. It's like this. There are some and we can use some. Podemos utilizar este cuantificador que significa algunos o algunas. There are some, some plants. Uh -huh. We mm. can use this manner too. There are some some plants in my living some room. Is, some is, is algunas. Algunos o algunas. Puede ser para masculino some. o femenina. Pero es para plurales y afirmativos. Solo para afirmativo. Para negativo vamos a utilizar any, que significa ninguna. ninguna. Exactly. That's correct. Pero estos nada más son para poner énfasis. No es que sean necesarios ahí en la oración. In the case of negative, you have there are no drawers. No hay gaveteros. Drawers son gaveteros. There are no drawers in the living room. Or there aren't any. O sea, dos son formas de negativo. There are no drawers in the living room. Or there aren't any drawers. Ropero. That's a closet. Drawer. Ah, closets. Drawers es gaveteros, ¿verdad? Gaveteros, ajá. It's like the dressers, como los dressers. Mm -hmm. Closets es donde colocamos la ropa, right? Closets. Y aquí le llamamos ropero, right? But they are the closet. So two forms of negative. There are no or there aren't any. So let's see. Now. Oh, teacher. Yes, tell me. Uh, how do you say juguetera? That's a, you can say it a shelf. A shelf. shelf. 
Mm -hmm. Shelf. Shelf. What happened is that we call like that. Nosotros le llamamos juguetera. Pero en sí es, son repisas. Donde comúnmente se puede poner el televisor. Exactly. Ajá. O el, mon el, el montón de, 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 de cositas. El tipo de sonido. Ajá. De decoration. Ajá. Con, y hoy right? casi no se ven las Ornaments. jugueteras. Hoy más que todo se ya ve. Casi, ¿no? No, ajá. That's true. Vaya. Y They para, evitar, very different. Mis, yes. para evitar, por ejemplo, juguetera, eh, closet, esto... Si yo quisiera colocar, si yo quisiera decir de una sola vez, mueble, en una forma general, es a shelf. Ver, módulo. Tengo que especificar para qué es. A shelf, a shelf. But in the case, for example, if you use it to organize the books, then you better use a bookcase. Si pero decir, vaya, pero ese me está diciendo que es para libros. Es for books. Correcto. Also Entonces, yo, you si can... yo quiero decir solamente un mueble. Un es a shelf. Y ahí puede ser una, una librera, puede ser este un, una juguetera, como decía. Cualquier decimos. mueble. Ajá. Ajá. Any, any. Ajá. Cualquier mueble que le llamamos un estante porque es para organizar Correcto. cosas. Es a shelf. Es un Sin especificar para qué. You don't specify. No especificamos. Okay. Ahora, si quiere especificar, entonces el bookcase. Ah, entonces sí, ya sabemos, ¿verdad? Que es el organizador para los libros. O la librera. We call la librera, right? That's a bookcase. Pero en general, a shelf es un, es, en, un estante, un organizador. Mm -hmm. So that's a shelf. But if it's clear, la... it's shelves. Las repisas. Shelves. Okay. It's, it's the plural case. So, estante, repisas, they are shelves. Singular and shelves is the plural manner. Yes? Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Now, we were here with the plural, right? Now, give me examples then with the plural. Sandra Guadalupe? Now, you need to use the R. Miss, una pregunta. Yes, tell me. ¿Cómo se dice eh, lo, lo, los cojines o no sé cómo es que se... Kilos. 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 Yes. Todos Thank tenemos cojines en la casa. Ah, yes. They are necessary. You're <laughs> welcome. Yo, yo yeah, duermo como con cinco. Oh, yes, I, just, I have like three on my bed. They are necessary. <laughs> to sleep Ajá, correct. Cojines. Cojines o almohadas. Ajá, that's, that's a general manner. Dice mi niña, mami, yo ya puedo inglés, ¿por qué? Ya sabes cómo se dice ama almohada. No, ¿cómo lo? Pispilo, me dice. Ah, Pispilo, with the eyes. <laughs> They sound similar, right? This pillow. <laughs> <laughs> Good. All right. Miss, Tell me. Corríjame, vaya. En el caso de que, de que sean oraciones eh, negativas en plural, eh, they are not a pen in the, talbo, in the table of the little. There are no. There are no. no there are no pens. A pen. Pens. Pens, correct. Why? Because it's plural. Ajá, that's good. There are no pens on the table. On the table. Ajá. Of the, the table. living room. Of the living room. Yeah, that's correct. As is plural, then you use plural here of the elements. Correct. Sí. Y yo lo sabía. There are no pens. Solo no, se puede no, colocar there, there are no. You can say also there aren't. There aren't. Right There aren't. De las dos formas se puede, se puede In the usar. negative. Ajá, that's correct. But if you mm -hmm. use negative, there aren't any pens. No hay ninguno lapiceros. Pens. But that's to put more emphasis. Este cuantificador any es para darle como más énfasis. Pero no es que sea necesario en realidad colocarlo. Any pens uh, on the table. 
So you have two options. There are no or there aren't any. Two manners that you can express it. Let's continue then. Melba, Melba Patricia, can you give us another example? We are with plural. Melba, are you present? Solo iba a ser como oyente, creo. Oh, mis... yes, she said. Thank you, thank you. Igual Alba. que Nia Vanessa tiene problemas con el, has... con el, con with la audio, conexión. Right? With con la conexión. conexión. Yes. Sí. Thank you. Alba. Nia Vanessa y Estaro. Pero es que ya había puesto mm -hmm. que tenía problemas con la conexión. Sí, es que como está yeah, lloviendo, so... el... ahí sí, pero por eso me han visto así casi así encima de la compu, porque casi <ríe> <laughs> it's connection es problems for the rain. <laughs> Aquí está lloviendo fuerte también. Yes. Alba? Sería, there are two plants. Ah, that's good. Yes, there are two plants. In the living room, right? In the living room. Look, that here. It's not necessary to say only there are some. You can also say a specific quantity. There are three, there are five, there are some. Just that some is a general quantifier. Some es solo para generalizar la cantidad. Algunas plantas pueden haber dos, pueden haber tres o más. But with the specific yes. number also is possible. Yes. Entonces, en este caso, allí en el área del living room, podemos decir, there are animals, refiriéndonos Perfect. a que hay un gato, una tortuga y un ratón. Yes, that is true, yes, because there is existency. Siempre que queramos expresar existencia de algo que hay o no hay, perfecto, se puede utilizar. Give me the example, please. Yes. Give me your example. There are there are animals in the living room. Excellent, that's good. There are animals in the living room. Y esto se yes. puede ocupar en lo que sea. Exactly. Animales, cosas. Persons, yes, en general. You can okay. use it for persons too. In the case here, you can say that there are no people in the living room, no hay personas, like here. There are, or there aren't, can also say, there aren't. Mi teacher things. said, yes. Ajá. Este estaba pensando también, no sé, corríjame. Este, ¿Sí? en específico, este, eh, mouse sería, there, there siempre, there are it. There is. En este caso, como solo hay un ratón, es de Riz. Is there. Ajá. Only there. one, right? Is no es here. conejo. Is that a rabbit? No, yo creo que es una rata. No, Será un hamster. Es, es, es Mickey Mouse. Is that Mickey Mouse? No, yo ¿Qué? creo que es conejo. Es que es sí. muy grande para que sea ratón. Pero las orejas son chiquitas. Sí, They are es small Mickey ears. Mouse. I think it's Mickey Mouse or, or Minnie. <laughs> I don't know. No, de los que comúnmente llamamos acá cuyos. Cuyos, right? En Perú no me recuerdo cómo le llaman, pero aquí cuyos, cuyos porque es bien grande. Como que es contuse, mire, hola. Pero es que Ajá. hoy en día los ratones están bien ah, No, están bien alimentados. They eat a lot of food. <laughs> Comieron semillas. O será un hamster. I think it's a hamster. Look, las orejas son pequeñas. Uh -huh. and, look, and, and look at the, the legs, las patitas son chiquitas. En Perú le llaman cobayas. Cobayas. Cobayas, porque ah. son grandes, son grandecitas. Que aquí le dicen cuyos, pero en Perú son, son cobayas que vienen en diferentes colores. Eh, había una película, no me recuerdo cómo se llamaba la película, que salían unos con copete, no sé si recuerdan, y son bien grandes, por eso es que está bien grande ahí la, la imagen. Los trolls. <ríe> si fueran rabbit, <ríe> las orejas fueran grandes. Ajá. Más largas. And look, they are small. 
son pequeñitas. They are small ears. Pero se ve más como que fuera hamster. Uh -huh. No, los hamsters son chiquitos. It's a mix. Pero entonces sería una mezcla en específico. There is. There is. There is a it's... hamster. Or ah, ah, ah. let's suppose that is a hamster, right? Uh -huh. But you don't need to use it. Aquí no rabbit, rabbit hamster. It. A rabbit hamster. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> there is a hamster. El it ya no lo utilizamos porque está mencionando el nombre específico. El nombre. Ah, Ajá. Okay. There is a hamster. Okay. Entonces, mm -hmm. ¿cómo queda la oración, Miss? There is a hamster in the living room. In the living room. Mm -hmm. In the living room. Mm -hmm. Because it's only one. It's existence of one hamster. It's singular manner. There are pets. There are animals. But that will be for the plural cases. How, how do you say portarretratos? Portrait. Let me see. Podríamos okay. decir they, they are some, some portrait, portraits in my living room. Here is only one. Bueno, en este caso solo hay uno, ¿verdad? There is a portrait. Portrait. But, but if you're describing yours, si usted describe el suyo, you can say there are some portraits. Algunos. There, so, there are some portraits, portraits in my living room. Portraits. In my living room. Right, that's good. Miss, in my living room, este, in my bedroom. Yes. ¿Y cómo se dice para poner las llaves? Así como esa cosita que está a la parte del, del, como de la this foto. This one, this one. This one will uh -huh. be a, a key holder. Key holder. Key holder. Okay. Porta llaves. Mm -hmm. oh. That's a key holder. Thank you, Miss. So, yes, you're very welcome. Any other question? Question. No. El que sostiene la pantalla siempre se dice rack. Yes, uh -huh. it's a rack. It's a rack. They are, they are, it's a rack in my living room. There is. There is. There is. There is, there is a, a rack. There is a rack. There is. Singular, right? There is a rack. Is a rack. Is I know I sería there isn't. There isn't, uh -huh. if it's negative, there isn't, or there is no rack in the living room. There isn't a rack in the living room. Now, if it's plural, okay. then you say there are no racks in the living room or there aren't any racks in the living room. All it depends, uh -huh. right, if it's affirmative or if it's negative or if it's singular or the plural case. Otro yes. ejemplo podría ser there are there isn't eh, uh, a dog. Digamos, no hay un perro uh -huh. in the living room. There is no. <clears throat> there is there no, is no dog. dog. Uh -huh. Or there isn't no dog. a dog. There isn't. Uh -huh. That's good. There is no dog or there isn't a dog in the living room. In the living room. Uh -huh. okay. That's all right. Teacher. Yes, tell me. Y esta, esta semana está, están evaluando entonces la, la, el, la sección 3. Section 3. Pero no hemos terminado todavía la 2, ¿verdad? Más que nos atrasamos por el día de ayer. Entonces, traten de avanzar hasta lo que ustedes puedan. Ok. okay. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. Then we are going to continue tomorrow with this. Okay. Thank you very much. Uh, Tell me, you have questions? Y será correcto que diga, there is my baby in the living room. No, porque si no iría como, hay mi bebé. Ah. Es mejor utilizar, mi bebé está, my baby is. My baby is. Ajá, my correcto. Baby. Porque no es existencia de un bebé, sino que el bebé está en un lugar. Y si quisiera decir, hay un bebé en la sala. Ah, that's Ajá. different. Then you can Yo say. Yo creo que sí lo quería decir. Ajá, maybe, maybe different way. There is a baby. Sin el posesivo, porque no es, hay mi bebé, sino hay un bebé. There is. There is a baby. A baby. 
in, in the living room. And it can be in the living room, it can be in the bedroom, living room. Uh -huh. There is a cat. It's like the same, the same structure as with the animals. There is a cat. There is a man in front of my house. There is a doctor in the clinic. There is, there is. Or there are. There are two babies in the bedroom. There are two babies. There are some babies. Some babies. Algunos. Aha, uh -huh, that's good. For affirmative. Some, solo es para afirmativos y plurales. Y los demás igual, ¿verdad? Los que leamos, pero es negativa. There are no, there are no babies. Or there aren't any babies. So any and no is only for negatives. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Miss. Thank you, teacher. Thank you very much. Any other questions? Bye, Timmy. Yes. Good night. All right. Thank you so much. Miss. Thank you. Yes, tell me. Miss. Mire, este... Ya mandaron para que mandemos, para que nos inscribamos al módulo 3. 3. Al 3. Ya, Ajá. ya, ya lo, están pidiendo ya la información. Ajá, ya lo están pidiendo. Ya nos es... declararon que vamos a pasar el módulo 2. Es to be positive. Sí, porque eso está... You can do it. Eso estaba bien. Yes. Ajá. Me dice de algo. Tell me. Um, aún no estoy en el grupo de chat del módulo 2 no aparece verdad no ok eh, por Muy ejemplo ayer me fui a la clase solo estuve con una compañera uh -huh. y como igual no sabía ahí estuve como hasta las nueve y cuarto ah oh, ok alguien más que no aparezca para notificar eso solo Rafael los demás se aparecen en el grupo de chat sí Yes, ok, entonces voy a, voy a notificar eso para que ellos puedan solucionarle. Ok, gracias. Okay. Thank you, guys. Have good a night, miss, que siga mejor. Have a good, thank you very much. Ay, thank ay, you miss. for your comprensión. No me sale medicina como es. Thank you, miss. Ah, I bad medicine. Night. Thank you. Yes, thank you, test, thank you very much. Muchos test. Yeah, that's true. Tomé mucha loratadina para ay, la garganta. Yes, adormita, <laughs> Tecito de manzanilla. Siendo Y de repente. Y de repente. Y de repente. Y de Y de repente. Y de de Y de de Yes, thank you, Miss. Good thank night. you, guys. Have a good night. 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 Bye. I miss you so much. Good night. Good See you night. tomorrow. Bye. Have a... See you tomorrow. Thank you. Good dreams. Sweet dreams. Take care. Have a good night.